Hey guys, how did came in here today? I'm in snow pants and my USR jacket. It's like, I'll fit my camera out. It's like 20 degrees where I'm at right now. And a fixed stand in the chair, by the way. So his head's twitching because it's like, since so it's 20 degrees out, the head is like, it's like, the gears are like cold. It's a metal gear. I put my hand on there, dude. It's like freezing. So I did, I, 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 I put like, a garage lubrication there is helping. Should have kicked back on soon. I fixed it. My, the photos, then I found out what the problem is. Because all this stuff's on one timer. This has to be on, on a separate timer by itself. Because I have two strong fans in there. And they need one whole outlet to have so much power. I did that. So I had to pull a tether on this back of the chair so it evens it out. So, and it fights great, guys. Zoom out a little bit for you. If it flies great, I fixed the hand so I brought the hand out more. I turned it a little bit, taped up here and it blows up more. So head will be twitching. Tomorrow after school, after my own, I get my haircut done. I'll come out here and try and mess with the head a little bit. See what I can do. But the presence, ever since I had this inflatable, the presence have always been leading back. I've always come out to try doing it. They just always lean back. I probably could get a tether for it and pull it on this side where it evens out, but I don't care. And when I'm flex sealed, I'm, I, I want to try and buy like an m off eBay, like a, a 2012 one as like a piece of crap and just take the holly berry off, take the holly berry on there. Yep. But keep on this sled. They're just dead and getting low on me. Their heads are heavy for the bodies. So I might be ordering a YEF 200 for these guys next year. Turn out good guys. And I'm getting that 10 foot nutcracker to move something up. Oh, arms up and down. Looks amazing. Here's the back of it with the windmill glow fan and the YF200 underneath of it. It has like, it, it's tomorrow. It's supposed to be like 50. It's supposed to be like tomorrow's supposed to be in the 60s. So I'll let that gear heat up a little bit in there. And we should be good. This guy was, I could all sand back there, I think. So, fall backwards. Yep, so, Pluto. We got. I'll show you what I add to my display. I added, uh, I got bush lights. I had two white bush lights. I added this guy. Other oh, ice lights, I'll show you in the video. I got bush lights on there. And I added that sand head protector and move the reef. Not too big. I mean, my one year display was like, I went all out and dead serious. I mean, a lot of breaking on me, guys, so I can't go all out anymore. So this thing is down here, and it's, it's the candy cane snapped. So I have to leave it down. I tried putting it back up. I meant to get a stick for it, like I did for the other. Yeah, that right hand will sneeze. Okay, I got it. I think it new light for his head. I, I think I have a spare light in the box. I do. Santa, he's leaning because he's talking to the bush. I didn't move the stake over. And. Oh, trip on him. Already. Yep. Got two spotlights on him. See, so yeah, he's on key circuit. Keep on switching until I fix the um, head. Uh, so, this, so these. Ever since he got these, these candy canes never inflated. This, this is like a, a D Factor VR where I look inside. Jemmy had these. Kitty canes, like, oh, so I think there used to be sewn up there, but I'm like, I don't care. The inflatable is more important to me than the small stuff, but I spread it if it doesn't work. I'll show you the things that my grandmother did bought. It's this thing. Oh, okay. She bought me, I got that from my great grandmother's. And this, my great voice my grandpa's display. This was the last thing his, my grandma bought. So her name was Trina, so I called her Grandma Trina. And I miss her dearly, guys. She died in 2012. And this was 2011. Well, this thing she bought, I remember going with her that day. I was only like, I'm 12, I don't know. I forget how old I was, I'm about 12. I'm like 13, something like that. I forget how old I am, I don't know. But I forget how old I was. I was a sad day when I found out. And I think she died 12 years ago. Something like that. And I have, I got her sand in the chair. 
Oh, I, I, I had to make pictures of this and like upload to YouTube so you guys can see everything, but he is fixed now. All I had to do was mainly take the bottom of that up and plug him into the other outlet. I moved the arm more on an angle so it looks more inflated. This arm, I put flex tape on it and it's just making it heavy. When we first got it, the arm did go like this, which is thin and the flex tape on, so the arm is always just gonna hit down like that. Tomorrow's gonna be 60 degrees out. I'll come out and I'll fit, uh, like, let the gear warm up on the head. If not, then I gotta fix that screw in there. And I gotta put the screw tighter. My, cause I have a drill in there. I have a screw. I think the screw's getting loose. So I'll have to go back in there and drill it in tighter. Or I'll put a new screw in there. Oh, let's go ahead and re-drill it in there pretty good. These are my childhood. This is my aunt, she's like 90 now. And I gotta get a zip tie, I put tape on here. And, excuse me, sorry about that, excuse me. And this hang up Santa was hers. That, oh, and I added this too, guys. Look up there, I got a snowman flag. The Santa flag was hers. I should go to her. That Santa thing right there was hers. And there's a snowman flag up there at like mail. So yeah, guys, I'm really happy how I fixed it. Everything. That spot needs to be on my attitude spot because I wire lights on them. Here it is, guys. So I'll make a video tomorrow of me fixing them. But check out the Circus Maximus. I watched a live stream of their sand chair. And I just want to say, because this is how the sand chair should look like. Where it was brand new, it looked just like this with only one fan. It has two fans. YF1, 200. And the YF200. And one more glow fan. Last year I had a 125, but I swapped out with 200. Works great. So, all right, guys. Thank you for watching. If you don't see me, have a merry, merry Christmas and a happy new year, guys. I will get that video uploaded when I get my thing. So, have a happy new year, guys. I'm ready for 2022. As you know, 2021 wasn't the best year for me. As you can probably see my TikTok channel, Cole Moyer, the Cole Moyer is us too. The Cole 207, we're in long Cole 207, about my dogs. You can check it out, have it on my YouTube too. So rough, I had, it was a really rough year for me. We got through it and I hope 2022 is a better year, guys. So thanks for watching. Have a Merry Christmas if I don't see you. And have a Happy New Year. Peace out. God bless you all.